when you look at that relationship between a shipper and a carrier, especially, you know, when the market was in the carrier's hands, which was, you know, not less than six, eight months ago, the big thing that we tried to focus on, again, is just being upfront and honest with them, letting them know where we're at. It's really been imperative for our sales team, myself and, and our senior leadership team to be in touch with our customers, having conversations, supplying them with facts, letting them know what's going on in the industry and more so what's going on at CFI. We try to share as much of that as we possibly can. We're an open book. We really believe in, in developing those relationships and, and ultimately that's what's made CFI successful for 71 plus years now. We probably are not as aggressive as what some of the other carriers may have been during that time frame when rates were really strong and capacity was in high demand. We were turning down three to 4,000 loads a week. We gradually moved our pricing, but we, we were trying to be very conservative in our approach and make sure that we were being uh, a relationship driven carrier. And ultimately that's where we hope to be able to maintain through these peaks and valleys that, you know, we're not seeing major ups or major downs in our rate structure. And that way it gives us stability to be able to go through both scenarios. And that's really been our focus over the last five years.